What up pilots? Let's talk about the manual engine control and trimming on a Focke Wolf 190 Dora. Engine on. Manual engine control on. It's going to have no oil radiator. This is an inline version of the Focke Wolf. So let's go with 60% radiator, magneto 1 plus 2, no mixture, no turbo, no super, do not touch the prop pitch. Alright, throttle up about half weight. Throttle up all the weight. Fix that torque. About 120, 130 knots. Lift up, gear up, collapse up. So we're wanting to roll to the left, so let's rudder trim to the right and aileron trim to the right. Trim for climbing. Once you trim this out in a test flight and save it, you will not have aileron trim or rudder trim to use in a match. Only elevator trim. This is a Focke Wolf, so this is a boom zoomer, pure boom zoomer. You could get away with energy fighting in this thing, but I would not energy fight, say, a Spitfire or anything like that, or a Yak. I would only energy fight like a P-47 or a P-38. Maybe a P-51. Anything else, though, I would just gain distance. And then once you have enough distance, turn back around, do a hammerhead, take a shot, do it again, hit and run. This is also the same as a TA-152. This is basically going to be the same type of fighting style. The TA-152s, the H model is pretty good at high altitude energy fighting though because of those long long wings but still I would stick to boom zooming first Always try to get the altitude and speed advantage over your opponent before you engage. Alright, let's level out here. Gain our speed, set our trim to zero.
if your aircraft does not have oil radiator and you're using manual engine control your engine will overheat when you're at a hundred percent or if you wept too much so if overheating is a problem fly around at ninety percent until you get into a combat situation it's about as good as we're gonna get it so let's save that and this is a focke wolf so you can get away with diving as much as you want stay fast boom zoom and that's a 190 Dora